Hi guys, it's Luke from Luke's Mushrooms. We have Saturday the 16th of March 2023 and in this video I will show you some spring mushroom finds that I was able to find today in Slovakia and also in previous weeks in either Slovakia or Czech Republic. So let's start. Plenty of scarlet elf cups. I really like this group for example. And here we also have a rare variety of orange colored ones. It should be the same species, just different variety. It's many of them here. And these are enormous, very huge. compared to my hand. So the first success seems like it's Verpa Bohemica here. But this one is too small and too dry so I will not touch it. However it's really good to see that it's a new spot for them here. Very nice. I'm just few meters further from the previous one and this is how it looks here. Here in these bushes something was hiding. Something very well visible and very good looking. Verpa Bohemica early morel or false morel it looks really nice I took a picture of course and it's my first good find of these species this year Still many scarlet elf cups. It's just few meters from the previous Verpa. And I have some more here. I will definitely take this one. Looks very good. The stem is quite long. There are a few more here. This one seems to be quite damaged. But with this one looks good. So we have two more which I'm taking. I've just found a spot with plenty of them. Unfortunately most of them are huge and dry. So I will be quite picky about which one I take and which not. But I will show you as many as possible. They can get pretty huge this one compared to my hand and this one also looks quite in a good shape I will just maybe cut part of the leg of the stem but I also saw some smaller and more fresh looking ones we will get to them This one is pretty dry. Here 
There is a smaller one which is very fresh looking and I really like it. So this one will go with me. Another one which looks quite fresh. This one maybe, for now I will leave it. So I have these three. And I saw more of the big ones or dry ones. So seems that for this particular spot I'm a bit late. But something can be still found. one should also be okay and also this one looks very nice so as I said previously I will be picky but some of them look good Maybe also for a picture. This one. Or this one. I will take these two after I take pictures of them. So it's time to take these two as well. They look quite fresh. Beautiful one. I saw something very well hidden. This one is maybe the best shape so far from today because of the size and freshness and only when picking that one I have noticed another one which is well camouflaged here it's quite adventurous to find one and then discover more this one is smaller but also very good looking so that's two and then these two a bit drier but still looking good And I can see two more. These are a bit different color. More yellow or orange tones here. The previous ones were more gray. So here they are together. Just a second look at the place with so many of them and there is one more which definitely looks very good.
And as we already have a few of these mushrooms, I would like to say something more about this species. So it's called Verpa bohemica in Latin and the English names could be early morel, timble morel, wrinkled timble morel or even false morel for some people. It's not true morel, it's a species which grows early in spring and here in Europe it's considered to be edible but some people could have allergic reaction to it so you should be careful if you decide to eat it and not eat it again if you feel sick after the first time. So I came to another bushes and I found a spot with several early morels, Verpa bohemica, the same species as previously. However, these look a bit older and dry. A bumblebee was flying here. So most of them look the same as this one. There are two. There is another one. One more. And it continues like this. Further back in the bushes I can see more of them and probably some of them will be in a good shape to take so if there are such I will show you. It's not easy to move inside of these bushes but here is one I want to take which still looks quite good and there is one more this one it's really looking nice and fresh so at least these two will go with me from here this is how the area around me looks like so mostly some dense bushes and I was walking on the road and I have noticed at first this old huge and dry one which almost looks like a stinkhorn and then I noticed a similar one next to it However, there are more and some of them could be good to take, so I will check this area and then I will show you which ones I pick. I'm on my knees here in the bushes and there are a few nice ones. For example, this one looks very nice. A little bit dry, but still should be good enough to take. This one will stay here. This one looks very fresh. Really nice. One more that I'm taking and I saw a few other but I will need to reach them from the other side. So for now we have these three. So here are the three and I'm entering the bushes to take some more or show you some more.
this one is a little bit damaged but maybe it will be usable and this one looks very good also quite well camouflaged looking quite fresh and quite huge and there are some more small ones here for example and probably many others back there but these bushes are so dense that I will not go there here is a nice yellow brain and I'm taking a picture of it. At some places of this forest there are nice bunches of snowdrops. Beautiful spring or end of winter flowers. I like this bunch the most. Here I was taking pictures of these mushrooms which grow on dead wood and they are supposed to be glowing at night on a green color so that should be called the luminescence. I have some nice scarlet elf cups here. Of this one I'm taking a picture. And there are a few more which I noticed. You just need to uncover some of the leaves. This one is very nice. I expected many jelly mushrooms today because they like to grow in cold weather but I completely forgot about wood ears that's a nice mushroom that likes to grow in cold weather too I'm still in this uglier part of the forest and I'm taking pictures of some scarlet elf cups. This one is the first I found. It's very tiny. And behind it we have some velvet chunks together also with one small scarlet elf cup here we are at the place which I showed in several of my previous videos we have orange oysters here and it seems like they are here the whole winter these are in a very good shape and I also took some pictures of them. So here are all verpas that we have found today still 
I will probably discard a few of these because I need to carefully check if there is some mold or if they are maybe too old or too dry. But I'm very happy for this find, it was my new spot and I hope you liked it too as well as the other footages from previous weeks. So that's it for this video. If you liked it then please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you are not subscribed already, share the video with your friends and check the links in the description below. So thank you all for watching and see you next time. Bye bye.